I'm back! Hello! It is day three of Vlogmas, and as you can see, I am currently in my car. I've just parked because adventures are happening today. Well, okay, I say adventures. I'm, I'm having lunch with Richard and Vaughn. And Vaughn, really, like, why? Why did you choose where we're going to eat? As in, why? Why this place? Okay, the parking is ridiculous. I. Honestly, I'm not sure how I'm going to get to the thing. I've parked like somewhere else. Uh, we'll see. Hello, I see you hella repping school. What? I see you being very... <laughs> Are you vlogging? Yes. <laughs> because apparently people decided that they want me, they want me to do vlogmas. What's up, what? Child. You missed my quota for the, for the day, no? Yes, because you are a growing child, right? Oh my gosh! Mm -hmm. Daddy's a big one. Holy shit, son. That is a big ass piece of What, you're not kidding me too? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, uh, for, on, on, on this note, right, I'm donating a piece of chicken to you, man. And probably to you yeah. as well. <laughs> This is huge! Oh my oh gosh! My gosh. What is that? Oh, okay. Yes, I can smell the bread. <laughs> the smell is actually really, really strong. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I mean, I would assume so because it's cream. Thanks for ordering that. Hey, no worries. <laughs> Thanks for bringing this here. I'm afraid. I'm still on my free lunch meal, so let me see if it's really good. Durian Kabbalah, Kabbalah Canteen. Like, it actually works. It works. Check it out. Awesome place. John Muchala. This child is dying because he decided to eat one chili buddy. Thank you. Ice cream. Soy ice cream. Oh yay. Sephora Black Friday stuff has arrived. This is mine, not my mother's. So at some point in the next few days, presumably, there will be another Sephora package arriving, except that will be my mother's Christmas purchases, but this this is mine. Yay! Briogeo. Oh yay! The drunk elephant. Ooh, hello. Okay. Can this thing be seen? Nope. This is the drunk elephant glycolic sample. Here is my tacha. And is this an actual moleskin? It is! Okay, I didn't need this, but it's a moleskin and if I could redeem one, I was gonna redeem one because moleskins are expensive. Yay! Stuff! Except I do realize that this does mean more stuff for me to have to actually pack up first because I have to still have to pack up my room. So I was gonna go over to the Zongshan building uh, to get a refill for my planner for next year from Anatomy, but then I realized that it's already 3 o'clock and I need to get a move on on clearing the soft toys. So I came home and so I am going to rest for a while because I am extremely full. And then on to the Hello Kitties. Okay, time to clear the soft toys. I mean, not this. This, this shelf is bags. The shelf is just handbags, so this well, this is not going to stay, technically, but this, these aren't getting cleared away. These aren't getting thrown away or anything. But now I have to see what of these two I'm going to keep 
and what I'm going to give or throw away. So I have two trash bags. One is to keep and one is to throw. The keep also includes the I am not sure about this stuff and let's hope two bags are enough. Uh, this is Timon from the Lion King musical and the tag says remove tag and all plastic fasteners before giving to children. This was definitely given to me as a child and this tag is still here. Boring! What is this elephant tape on my owl? <laughs> Technically not Hedwig, but squishy. So far, the keep bag is getting more filled than the throw bag, which is not really a good sign. What do I do? What do I do, Mr. Cow? Okay, I guess you're going in the unsure slash keep bag for now. I feel like I need to keep the monkey just on principle of it being a monkey. Oh my gosh! I do not know why I had that. Honestly, thank god I am not asthmatic. Otherwise, this would be a lot harder. This... <laughs> this alligator has definitely seen better days. <sighs> okay. Hello, internet. I would like to introduce you to Amanda Rabbit. This is the first soft toy I have ever had. And apparently I actually still have her. What do I do? This is my baby. Like, look. She's missing an entire patch of fur. Her body is really squishy. Like, that is devoid of any fluff. But she was my first soft toy! What do I do? <laughs> She's going in the keep pile for me. So as expected, the keep slash unsure what to do bag is much more full than the give slash throw away bag. Great. I think part of the problem is because like, here I have Amanda. My first baby and then i have i have like pluto and pluto is still in really good condition and it's like it's an actual disney toy and i feel i feel like i should keep all of the beanie babies because you know y2k beanie baby craze etc etc so like this is the problem will i be able to fit this entire bag onto just one of these okay so now it is time to deal with this cupboard i think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the books into backpacks, which luckily I have. Apparently, I actually have like a shit ton of them, so that should work. I hope it's enough. And then all of these small things are gonna go probably into this trolley. Uh, definitely the stuff that's on my cupboard will be going into here because those are breakable the pops the pops the pops may actually go into that box i oh actually no i don't think it'll fit maybe the pops will go maybe the pops will go here uh we'll see lighter than the other bags but I swear that there are more books in here okay never mind okay good okay so you know how yesterday I said that I was a hoarder because I still had stuff from college say hello to my ad books from secondary school 
Well, so shit, I thought I actually had kept my Kajian Tempatan books from primary school, but I guess I did actually give those away. Or rather, throw those away because they're definitely obsolete with the current primary school syllabus. But yes, ta-da! We have cleared out! Oh, actually, no, I can't count that one. That was never books. This is one non-fiction shelf. There is technically some more non-fiction-y things here. That's going into one more bag. I have three bags worth of non-fiction books. This is my plan. Shove everything in backpacks and tote bags. Yes, I am smart. That suitcase is going to be for that. <laughs> that not gonna be fun. I think that, that, that is definitely tomorrow's, tomorrow Kathleen's problem, okay? That's not happening today. That's tomorrow Kathleen's problem, okay? Just when I thought I outdid myself in terms of hoarder tendencies by saying that I still have my SPM at Mads books, this is my planner from Form 2. Shit, son. This is my planner from Form 2. And even better, I still have... No, it's not that. All of the so-called chat messages that Farah, Romina and I used to literally just send this paper back and forth in here. And I still have all of this because that really is how much of a hoarder I am. And now I'm just going to... So basically, actually, if I, if I just put this back here for a while, 2006, 2007, 2008, this is 2008, right? Yep, 2008. I don't have 2009. I'm not sure why. I don't remember why I don't have 2009. Okay. 2010. This is the Starbucks one. Which... Oh yeah. 2011 was a gigantic one which I just really couldn't keep because it was so big. 2012, 2013, 2014, 2015, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019. And obviously when the year ends, 2020 is also gonna fit in here. Actually no, 2020 is going to end up being in this anatomy storage box. Right, that's 12 years of planners in one bag. Honestly, I'm really surprised by how well this bag has survived because I bought it in some really random shop. I don't actually know what material this is. I'm so surprised it has not started flaking. It's been sitting at the bottom of a box with other bags and like these knobs still turn like they're not stuck i am amazed that it is still alive so that's done that side which were books is done all of these are cds that oh geez so <laughs> veggie tales i don't know how many of y'all know veggie tales these are tapes which i may show in another video when i get around to clearing that and the shelf the row of notebooks is cleared. This is the result. Four backpacks, two totes, and one whatever you're gonna call that sling bag. Look at all of my Funko Pops just in a box. Voldy looks very very upset about being there and probably more upset about being underneath Pusheen or sorry underneath Pusheenicorn. All of my breakables which unfortunately does include this chipped edge of a TARDIS mug! So sad, so sad. I love the breakable ornaments I have are in here because this way I can just roll them around. Roll this entire thing around without fear of, you know, dropping some shit. Why? Okay, that wheel feels very stuck. I don't know why. But yes, this is very sad, which is why when I... Thank God it's only the cover and so I can always just... Now nobody has to see that side. Hello, mother. Hello. Would you like to tell the people watching how much progress you have made from yesterday? Well, I've completed the second elf except for the gold tip hat. And obviously the silver. Huh. Yeah, the silver. I've lost the face. <laughs> Would you like to tell the people 
that it was a distorted face, so I have to correct it and make it sh make sure that it's even. Yeah. Balance. That's are it. you? Can you just? Are you sad? Yes. <laughs>